So please like and subscribe. Hey everybody, my name is Tommy Drone, and you're listening to me on the Pathfinder. Uh, let me turn this echo off. Okay, so I got the echo on right now. This is the Pathfinder 3. And this is the uh, microphone that it comes with. Just a basic, simple microphone you can see here. Now this is the Pathfinder 3. And uh, this is the Pathfinder, I guess the original. Here's, here are the boxes. Both sell for around $150, Pathfinder 3, as well as the original. I've had this for a year now. And I just picked this one up. Now, the reason I got two is because you can actually send a signal back and forth between the two speakers and use both simultaneously, and that's a really cool feature. However, I got to tell you, the reason I'm doing this review is not only do I like them both, I actually think the newer Pathfinder 3 is a little bit better. This is only 100 watts, where the Pathfinder 3 is 120 watts. It puts out more volume, and I think the sound is clear too. Let me explain to you what I'm looking at. They both use Bluetooth, and what I'm going to do here is show you guys the differences in between the two and why I like them both. And uh, this is the Pathfinder 3 here that you're hearing right now. I've got the volume up to about, I guess, number seven. And what I like about this one, listen to the sound. Very clean, very clear. You can adjust the uh, treble and the bass. And I like that. I like that a lot. It gets pretty loud. So that was the Pathfinder 3. Bluetooth disconnected. Okay, and I'll turn this one on. No, turn that on. Bluetooth connected. Okay, now we're playing through the Pathfinder. I got the halfway up right now. The volume's halfway up. Not bad at all. So both have the same amount of inputs as far as the microphone goes. You have mic, mic, auxiliary, and line. Both have USB inputs. Uh, you can also use those to charge. Something else I've noticed is the new Ion Pathfinder 3 is brighter because it has two lights, not just one. And that does give you additional light. So when you're mm -hmm. needing that extra light, it does help to have that additional light. Uh, shooting out from the speaker. It just gives more light. That does come in handy. I do like that. Notice they're both the same height. And they're both about the same width. However, the Ion 3... The Ion 3 takes up less space than the Pathfinder. So the Pathfinder, the handles are on the outside. Where the Ion 3, the handles are on the inside. And that makes a big difference. And both have your nice rolling wheels. Both have things to move it around. However, something else I like about the Ion 3, the Ion 3 also has a bottle opener in the back. That's kind of nice. Both are easy to charge with your included plug. You just plug it in, charge them up. And both do a good job as far as music goes. Let me go ahead and put in my microphone again. You can hear the difference between the two. So again, here is the microphone for the Pathfinder 3. And I'll turn my microphone up to about, uh, we'll say 7. Turn my master volume up to 7. Hello. And right now, you're hearing me through the Pathfinder 3 here. How do I sound? Not bad. I can turn my bass all the way, but I usually keep my bass as high as I can, as well as the treble. However, if you're a person, you already have a lot of 
bass, you want to turn that down, you can. Notice I just turned down, and I do not have it all the way up. Let's go ahead and turn it all the way up so you can hear how it sounds. Got my microphone up, and there is the master volume. So I've currently got it at its peak volume. This is how I sound through the Pathfinder 3. How do I sound? Not bad, huh? Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, like that. And let's go ahead and try this one out. Okay, and this is the Pathfinder here. I'm going to go ahead and turn the uh, microphone all the way up. Does sound louder, doesn't it? That's interesting. I've noticed that. Okay, so here I am through the Pathfinder. Definitely does sound better with the microphone. And this is only 100 watts. That's surprising why this sounds better to me. Turn on that bass boost. And now I'm even louder through the bass boost. Again, this is only 100 watts. That's surprising. Wow. Okay, I sound really good through this. I like this. Let me go ahead and put it back to the Pathfinder 3. All right, Jacob, which one's louder? Oh, uh, let's see. All right, here we go. And now I'm going back through the Pathfinder 3 here. Got the volume all the way up. It actually seems to me like I had a stronger tone with the Pathfinder than the Pathfinder 3. What would you think? That one's louder, but that one's... This one's louder. But that one's more bassy. All right, so my son says this one's louder, and this one is more bass. All right, so more bass is coming out of this one, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go back to one more time, and let's listen again. Let's go plug this back in. Again, I got the volume all the way up. And now here I am through the path. This is definitely louder. So the Pathfinder, to me, sounds louder. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah, it's louder. He says it's louder, too. Uh, however, I notice I don't think I sound as clear as I do through the Pathfinder 3. What's your impression? Yeah. yeah. So the Pathfinder seems a little cleaner, a little more clear, where the Pathfinder has a lot more bass and uh, I hear a little bit more distortion through the Pathfinder. And, oh, you know what? Something else to consider. Let's listen for any noise in the background. Let's just listen, see if you hear any noise. I'll turn the volume down on this one. Hear that? You can hear that. Okay, let me turn that down. And let's turn this up. Again, you can hear the noise coming out from the speaker. Seems like I hear more from this one though. Hear that? Turn that down, turn this back up. So this has a higher pitch background noise. It says it charges your phone, however, it's not charging my phone, and my phone has wireless charging, but it ain't happening. No, it's not doing anything. All right, well, anyway, guys, work well, they're both great traveling speakers if you need it for a tailgate party. In my case, I have a lot of events that I hold outside, outdoor movie nights and so on, so these really, really work well. I use them all the time. So uh, if you're thinking about buying one, both really work well. It just depends on what you're looking for. I hope this review helps you out a little bit. If it does, please let me know. Like and subscribe and comment below. I'm Tommy Drone. Thanks for watching. I have the direct links for both speakers below, so check that out as well. And I'm Tommy Drone. Thanks for watching. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Okay. Was I recording? Power on. I think you were. No. Bluetooth you were. connected. Oh, it's still recording.